this week I have this 2017 Corvette Stingray in for a full detail and ceramic coating. The owner wanted the wheels coated as well, so we're gonna take those off later in the vehicle. But we start off with the pre-soak of a rinseless solution before moving on to the contact wash. The rinse of solution breaks down all of the dirt on the surface of the vehicle and emulsifies and encapsulates all those dirt particles, making the wash process much safer. This vehicle is in fairly good condition considering it travels back and forth between Maine and Florida and the owner uses it as his primary mode of transportation once he's in Florida. The vehicle was not significantly dirty so a rinseless wash was all that was needed to clean up the surface. The contact wash was performed using McKee's N914 and the Ultra Black Sponge by The Rag Company. Here we can see the emulsified and encapsulated dirt trapped in the water drops. High pressure steam was used to clean some of the intricate areas to get the dirt and grime that was hard to reach. The rag top was cleaned gently using a microfiber towel and rinse the solution. The vehicle was dried using this large microfiber drying towel by Glassparency. This towel can hold a significant amount of water, so even a large vehicle can be dried with a single towel. Once the vehicle was dried, I moved on to using Iron Remover by Glassparency as my clay lubricant and a synthetic clay mitt to decontaminate the surface of the vehicle. This removes any bonded surface contaminants, revealing a smooth finish and also removes any of the iron particles that may have been embedded in the paint over time. The iron remover will begin to dissolve any of the iron particles that have been embedded in the paint. The reaction will turn a purple color, indicating that the product is working. The vehicle was then rewashed using the rinse solution to remove any of the residual iron remover that was left on the paint. I then moved on to removing the wheels and cleaning the rims and preparing them for coating. I started off by pre-rinsing the wheels to remove any of the surface dirt and grime before moving on to using chemicals. To clean the tires, I am using Meguiar's non-acid wheel cleaner. This is a new product that I wanted to try to see how it compared against some of the other products that I'm used to. 
For the rims, I'm using Pianist Brake Buster diluted five parts to one and an IK foamer. 